Ladies. You look like you've just yeah. been to an office the memo. party. The <laughs> uh, it's lovely to have you both here. We've got so many questions, so let's fire yeah. away. Matthew Silk, Evening Matthew says, can you teach anyone to dance? Absolutely. Personally, I think you can. Yeah. To the level of what ability um, will depend on how many hours, um, whether they've got natural rhythm, but you can definitely teach anyone to dance. That the hard is work, blood, sweat, and tears. You just need to have will and you time to do it. Yes, yeah. and it's just will and patience sometimes. Exactly, patience. Exactly. And a good teacher. If you're passionate about something, you can do it because it comes from the heart. And then yeah. you can do anything you want. Anything, anything you, question, you want. Matthew. Even dance. Uh, um, Thomas <laughs> says, "What exactly does swing and sway look like in a waltz?" Because interesting this, because the judges keep saying some people have got it, some people haven't got it. Yeah. Could you demonstrate, perhaps? We can. Yes. 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 Uh, but swing and sway, you basically have them in most dances in ballroom apart mm. from tango okay so it's what would you would see it the most because it's the slowest sort of and you close your feet but tango is the only one where you don't swing and sway because it's flat That's and it's linear flat. tango is flat and linear okay so exactly linear to the, the floor yeah. okay and Go. when you swing and sway because it feels so nice you kind of tend to smile and in tango you can't smile and in tango you can't <laughs> this is very very simple okay let's see yeah. some proper swing and sway you start off oh, really yes. please, from the floor <laughs> lovely so okay. extra first, tall tonight Yes. Yeah, yeah. Come on, Lex. Let's dance with you. <laughs> so, uh, first we have a sway. Sway. Yeah. Nice. Looks it's like yes. that. Sideways. Okay. See? Okay. This One way to the other. Mm -hmm. You can't really? see that Look really. Look good. So this is sideways here. So there's no <laughs> rotation. Through hey, you look good the from upper that body. Side as well. Okay. <laughs> she looks good from every so side. Side legs. legs. Swing. Yeah. Swing is swing is that one. When you're, when you sort of like oh. throw a ball. Okay. Or nice. you wanna, you know. Looks like create some you're kind on of a, on a swing move. basically. Look. Oh, I see. Should we just show together? So if you put all yes. that together. So, so this is a uh, sway, sway, side to side, and, and this and is then a swing. Oh, <laughs> so is that swing. that's beautiful? Yeah. And we will yeah. all try and recreate <laughs> that perfectly. But yeah. you need to do both together in order to make it look right. Okay. You can't just do one because then it looks a bit. Swinging less or swaying less. Oh, and you don't want too much swing and too little swing. No. Well, okay. Can't have that. God, it's so complicated. <laughs> uh, George <laughs> Davis says, which professional dancer gets the most nervous before a show, and who is the most relaxed? Ooh, I mean, I get quite nervous. Yeah. Before. I think we all do. Yeah. Mm. In a good way, though, you turn nerves into energy, and if mm. you're not nervous, then it means I think you don't care, really, doesn't it? I think yeah. you need a little bit of nerves. Yeah. Generally, more nervous for my partner because you yeah. never know what's going to happen on live TV. <laughs> you they look at you with this blank look before you go out, and you think, "Oh, dear. they've forgotten me." Yeah, these fingers crossed. And Which leg do I start with? Oh, that's the... oh, <laughs> oh no. what have I been teaching you? <laughs> okay, Lynn Draper says, "How do the celebrity and pro girls stop their knickers from going up their bottoms?" Um, I think this is a very good well, question. Well, uh, for an example, look, here's Frankie doing her lovely sample with yes. her lovely pink pants. Off she goes. So how does that work, Natalie? Well, Maybe you could explain. I care to not demonstrate this one. Yes, please. <laughs> well, I don't know. Um, I think, you know, Vicky's amazing at DSI for making sure that everything remains where it should and in place. There's a lot of elastication throughout. Sadly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, the underwear and the, the costumes are so... You sort of went leotards. They're kind them. of leotards underneath, they are, aren't they? Yeah. they? yeah, okay. You have a full body suit underneath. Next question is from Patrick Reeve, and he says, what is the correct men's footwork for a tumble turn, please? Whoa. Mm. Okay, Patrick. <laughs> yes, I think it's going to take a demonstration. Yes. Okay. So you would start, have your weight on your left leg. You go, you're going to start back with the preparation step. You're going to go one, two, and three. When you get to three, you turn on three and you lower. So if you do that in one move, it looks one, two, and three. Nice. Wow. Well, that you never that good. You impressed yourself then, Ooh. didn't you? But to, um, in order to make it look good, you need a lady. Oh, yes, you. of course, of course. Man's footwork doesn't mean anything without ladies. <laughs> so, one, two, and three. Look at ah, that, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Absolutely beautiful. I wish we could do this all night because oh. I have so many questions. But that's all we've got time for. Give it up Thank for you. Natalie and Aliash. Bye bye. Thank you. Uh, Karen Hardy.
Hopefully we'll be back next Tuesday, but we've loved answering your questions so much that Ask the Pros will return every Thursday from next week. Hurrah! Yay! So if you have any questions, send them to us with the usual hashtag, AskITT. And finally...